Hello, I'm Craig and here are today's headlines from Pink 60. A scientist at USC in California has announced a breakthrough in a search for an HIV cure. Using a virus to hunt down and latch onto infected cells, he believes that suicide gene therapy can then be used to destroy them. Diana Nyad has given up a long-distance world record attempt after suffering a shoulder injury and asthma. The 61-year-old braved strong currents and possible shark attack on the swim from Cuba to Florida, but she finally quit on Tuesday. Rioting in London this week has affected queer movie distributor Piccadillo Pictures. The company lost its entire DVD stock in an arson attack at a Sony warehouse on Monday night. Owner Tom Abel said that all August releases will now be delayed. A third attempt to deport a Cameroonian citizen has failed again this week after the Air France captain refused to carry him, fearing disruption on the flight. UK immigration do not believe his claim to be gay and have refused his request for asylum. And finally, 50,000 revellers braved torrential rain on Saturday to attend this year's Stockholm Pride, with dykes on bikes heading up the main parade. After a week-long celebration, London's cabaret performer of the year, Miss Kimberley, headlined the weekend's closing entertainment. That's all for today. Join us again tomorrow.